This is Dave Daly with KaiserTV.com. We're here today at the Croc Center. I have with me here Janet Carlson. She's our Marion County Commissioner. And Janet, tonight we're here at the Croc Center learning about a kickoff of an initiative for youth homelessness. And share with our audiences, uh, you've had a long day. You're here in the evening. Uh, why this is such a great kickoff, and you as a commissioner here in the county, how do you feel about this project? Well, I was just overwhelmed. It was just a wonderful, wonderful experience. We have been working for several years at a policy level. Kathy Clark, uh, Kaiser Mayer, myself, uh, it was Anna Peterson and then Chuck Bennett and Jennifer Wheeler from Polk County to talk about how we might end homelessness. And uh, runaway and homeless youth was our number one priority that came out of our public safety steering committee. Wow. So uh, this was kind of a vision and a dream. Trisha Ratliff from uh, Community Action Agency was involved with our subcommittees and Cindy Linus actually chaired the subcommittee on public safety. But uh, now here we are and it's coming to fruition. We're at what they say on the 61st day, I think, of the 100 day challenge. So we've got some federal technical assistance to be able to move us forward. But better yet, they've announced actually that we're gonna have a brick and mortar shelter for runaway and homeless youth in our wow. community, which is just amazing. That's something that is huge gap in our community. Well, it's really a collaborative effort of assessing all of our resources as a community and uh, picking which ones we can pull off. But how does it feel to have youth be the face, the instigators, the leaders around this table? How does it feel? It feels like this is exactly the way it ought to be. If this is about youth, youth ought to be engaged. And I was so proud of the youth that were here tonight that, were, that spoke in front of a large number of people that organized the event, that uh, just you know had so much enthusiasm. Uh, this young man, Raul, from uh, McKay High School that's working on the United Way board to raise money for this house that they're gonna buy for the shelter. I mean, he was fantastic. The young woman uh, that, that told her story about uh, being homeless and all of the uh, challenges that she faced as a for throughout her whole life, and now she's a peer support for other kids, and so these are kids giving back to other kids that have experienced some very very difficult childhoods. Yeah, they really see it at their level. Their own classmates are leaving that school at three o'clock with nowhere to go. I can't imagine uh, what that would feel like in homework probably is a low priority when you need to w deal with shelter and food. So what a great initiative, but it's going to be a, a great success to circle back and, and continue this uh, work. But uh, just from our community, just want to express to you and our, our commissioner team the great efforts you're making for our county to champion all these causes. There's always not enough dollars to go where we want them to go, but it's a tough decisions you have to make. But Please express to your uh, other peers and the administrative staff of the county how much we appreciate what they do, and we see it and we appreciate it. Thanks. Marion County is just coming along beside. We're trying to help where we can. Grant writing, bringing people together. We've mapped the system and brought our mental health services from Marion County so they can connect up. Lots of great things that we can do. And we're, we're tracking this. We have a website, our mid Willamette Homeless Initiative website. We continue to do that and uh, working hard to just move it forward. Well, uh, check out the URL on screen to learn more information about the Homeless Initiative. Get involved. We had many community members, business organizations, nonprofits in this room tonight stepping forward saying, hey, we can shoulder this leg of the table. And uh, there's more people we need around this table. Wouldn't you agree? I agree. Yes, absolutely. All right. Well, thanks for talking with us, Janet. And for more great stories here in Kaiser, visit KaiserTV.com. Thank you.